The Integrated China Strategy Projects is an opportunity for students to work on a strategic challenge that is brought by one of our sponsor companies. The sponsor companies tend to be either companies who work closely with SEEDS over time, or in some cases they're uh, companies that are run by our alumni, and they bring in a strategic challenge that they're facing in the China context, and we give the students an opportunity to develop a strategic plan for them how to tackle that challenge. You know, sustainability is a big issue, not just in China, but across the world. And plastic recyclability is a big issue. So we're hoping the SEEP students can work through and look at, are there upstream and downstream solutions to this problem? Whatever solution you try to come up with, there's always pros and cons. And with the project we are doing right now, it's highly fragmented. There's a lot of stakeholders that are influenced by any sort of recommendations that we do. So it's a very complex and thrilling environment. The business society and environment module is most relevant to this project because our project is related to sustainability. So uh, in this module, it helps us to understand how a company can balance profitability and sustainability. It still is a consultancy project. So whatever you come up with, all the consultancy modules helped a lot, all the strategy modules helped a lot, because in the end you're making a recommendation for the next two to five years. So whatever you're saying has a strategic impact on your client. Familiarizing, doing a lot of uh, desktop research, and then trying to kind of like narrow down what are the deliverables you have, and then really go into the detail. Really go into the fields, interview people, talk to people, get a sense of what's going on. And then the third and last part is about strategy formulation. So it's really about like having all of the different puzzle points that you have, bring them together and formulate a, a consistent strategy that really makes a difference. One of our um, ambitions of this venture one is to get different perspectives on some of our big business problems. Uh, sometimes you get very insular in your thinking, so I wanted to get uh, you know, SEEPS graduates looking at some of these challenging problems and get a different point of view. The second objective was for, uh, selfishly, for SEEP students to get to know PepsiCo and PepsiCo of China. What do we have to offer as career options? What kind of business opportunities are there so that they might consider PepsiCo either for an internship or for a full-time opportunity? What I'm hoping the students get out of it is much more of an action-based learning, right? Because I've been a student before sitting in B-School doing these case studies, uh, and some of them have been written you know, a decade ago. I wonder how relevant they are to the immediate world that we live in. So we're hoping that these are real examples of real life cases of business issues a company like PepsiCo is dealing with, which hopefully if students get to work on, they develop their uh, strategic ability, uh, their project management ability, their analytical ability. So that's what we're hoping the SEED students get out of this relationship. Many of the professors who engage in this process actually do it partly because we have a window on what is the next phase of China's evolution, what's the next big thing coming along. So we've had just a really great opportunity to, first of all, um, see and participate in this massive digitalization of the Chinese economy. And now, as I said, we're you know on the cusp of uh, participating in this massive greening of the Chinese economy. We also also had um, participation in this uh, big shift in the nature of competition and the issues that companies were facing as the Chinese companies were developing and strengthening their competitive skills and the Western companies were learning how to operate in this very complex and, and fast-paced kind of an economy. So it's really just a great opportunity for everybody involved to be witnessing China's history as it unfolds and as we experience it day to day.